Welcome back everyone to a brand new video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to program everything with your Logitech G502 mouse. So pretty much I'm going to be showing you guys how to use push to talk with your mouse buttons on Streamlabs or Streamlabs OBS or just regular OBS. And I'm also going to be showing you guys how to rebind your Fortnite keybinds to some of your mouse buttons that won't let that they won't let you bind the two. So first, what you want to do is you want to open up the Logitech gaming software um, app. You can download this from the Logitech website. Um, so you want to go to here, and then whichever mouse button you actually want to rebind, you just have to click on that, and then um, you're gonna click on which um, button you want to rebind, and then you're gonna click on it, and then you're gonna click assign new command or edit command. You're actually gonna click edit command. You're gonna go here, and then you're gonna go to keystroke, and then you're gonna enter enter your keystroke, including any modifiers. So here you're just gonna click any single keys that you don't um, normally use on your keyboard. So I don't use F12 most of the time. So I rebinded my um what is what is it um. G, G whatever this key is right here I rebind it to F12 so now whenever I actually click this button it will transfer so the F12 will um, also transfer as this button right here so when I click this it'll um, go to the computer as a signal as an F12 so um now if I actually go over to Streamlabs OBS um, the way you ask to turn up on t push to talk for that I'll do Fortnite after this or any other game you got to go to hotkeys over here um, then you go all the way down um, and then you go to um, all the way down here um, and then you go to auxiliary audio device you go to push to talk and then you're just gonna click um, on the button that you rebind it to not the not the mouse button you're gonna actually click on the um, button that you rebind it to so say you clicked F12 you're just gonna type you're just gonna actually click F12 on your keyboard here and then it'll register as also your mouse um, when you're actually clicking it. And then if you go over to Fortnite, you're going to go over here to your keybinds. Hopefully this music isn't too loud. Hopefully you guys can still hear me. You're going to want to go, let's say I wanted to rebind my roof to something else because I kind of do want to. Um, I'm probably going to do this after the video. Um, you just click your roof and then um, I say I wanted to click that um, same button that I used for push to talk. Don't use the same buttons, by the way. Use a different one on your mouse. Um, I just click... Um, that button right there, and then it bind as F12. It's actually not going to be F12. Um, it can't. You can click F12 and now the mouse button at the same time. So both of them will work now. Um, so yeah, you can do this for any single key you want on your um, keyboard. That I mean, on your mouse that has not been binded already. So open up the Logitech app and um, then just click whichever button you want to rebind it to that you don't use on your keyboard again. Just go here. Then you just click it. Um, edit command, um, go to keystroke, F12, just click any key that you don't use a lot. Hopefully this video did help you guys out. I'm going to do many more tutorials, mainly Fortnite videos daily. Um, if it did, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.